Hey everyone, and welcome to AutoSpector channel. Today, we're taking a deep dive into the highly anticipated 2025 Hyundai Bayon. This little SUV has been generating a lot of buzz, and for good reason. So is it worth the wait? Let's find out. First up, let's talk about the exterior. The Bayon takes on a bold and stylish design language, with sharp lines, a sleek silhouette, and a confident stance. The front grille is prominent and eye-catching, flanked by LED headlights that give it a modern edge. The two-tone roof option adds a touch of personality, while the overall proportions are just right for city driving and urban maneuvering. Step inside, and you're greeted by a surprisingly spacious and comfortable cabin. The materials feel high quality, and the layout is intuitive and driver-focused. The infotainment system is a highlight, featuring a large touchscreen with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto compatibility. A fully digital instrument cluster is also available on higher trim levels, adding a touch of luxury. Under the hood, the Bayon offers a choice of fuel-efficient engines, including a 1.0-liter turbocharged three-cylinder and a hybrid option. Both engines deliver peppy performance for everyday driving, while the hybrid promises excellent fuel economy. The handling is nimble and responsive, making the Bayon a joy to navigate through tight city streets and winding country roads. Now let's address the elephant in the room, price. The 2025 Hyundai Bayon starts at an incredibly competitive price point, making it an attractive option for budget-conscious buyers. When you factor in its stylish design, spacious interior, and impressive technology package, the Bayon offers excellent value for money. The 2025 Hyundai Bayon is a small SUV that was launched in 2021. It has a recommended retail price, RRP range of 21,570 pounds minus 27,070 pounds. However, CarWow says that you can save an average of 2,028 pounds, and prices start at 19,511 pounds if paying cash. Thanks for joining me on this review of the 2025 Hyundai Bayon. I hope you found it helpful. If you're considering this little SUV, I highly recommend taking it for a test drive. You might just be surprised at how much it has to offer.